it's a big one, man. November yep. 11th. Let me see. It's like a month away. Not too long. So I'll be the first one online ready to download that. Yep. Well, I, I mean, like looking at these new features, I mean, you guys have covered a lot of ground across all the areas in Cubase. There's some great new plugins with the squasher and the multiband imager. Like it covers ground that you don't have to buy other plugins, you know, if you're getting into Cubase. That's amazing. And, and especially the export functions like how many hours of my day, are, are, you know, and I'm not the only one, I spent exporting files for mixing or different formats and delivering those sort of things. And now you can like, like Greg said, you can go have a coffee, hang outside while everything's being exported and to set up all these queues. That's a huge feature. I mean, that, that saves so much time. Well, I mean, it's one of the things that none of us really want to do at the end of the day is make stems. It's like the least creative thing. And you guys have just, you know, made it, so quick and and you know easy so that's that's a huge one yeah for me but yeah like seriously it's 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 awesome like i mean there's i know how much there already is in qa so every time it comes like november rolls around i'm like i wonder you know you guys must just be like what can we do to this program to make it better you know but i guess it's like and and you know it can be tough because refining new features or making things that are great ideas that maybe need improving. Like sometimes that's not the most exciting thing for people. Like, but for guys like me who have been using the program, it's like, like Greg, you probably realize guys are probably like hugging you now. Cause it's like, Oh my God, this is like, mm -hmm. uh, you know, that's what I needed, you know? So that's, but then you've got enough in there to get people excited who, you know, like plugins and that kind of thing, you know, like they're always, they're always fun to use, but if you're a professional, like, you know, and you're working at it every day, like I am, like the export function, like that is, you, you, I can't tell you how many times it's like, you know, I'm sitting on the couch and it's 10 o'clock at night and I get a call from like the label going, can we have these stems for live? Like we're doing a show on the weekend. I'm like, oh, okay, I'll go in the studio for two hours and set everything up. And now I can and just, I honestly, yeah. I could probably just remote Cubase to my phone and just like, do it from like my phone now you know and just like because you know with the remote screen sharing or whatever i could just do that and sit on the couch and make my stems it, and that'd be fun so i can't wait so yeah i want that feature now so can you just give me that that export feature now because i think i've got to make some stems this week so <laughs>